Josh Taylor versus Jack Catterall on February the 26th at the Hydro in Glasgow. Um, I feel like this is a mismatch. It's a mandatory, so I'm going to give you a quick prediction. Unless this is like Michael Gomez versus Alex Arthur, which it's not going to be, I don't feel, but unless Jack Catterall knows something that we don't, He's just going to be searching to headhunt. And whilst doing that, I just feel like Josh Taylor is going to ping him on the most insane counters. He's going to have the crowd and it's going to be a bit of a one-sided clinic. There may be areas where Catterall may trouble Taylor, but I really, really don't see it. I think this is, it's a mandatory fair play to Jack Catterall for taking this, but in a fight like this, it is all about levels. And Josh Taylor, for me, should get the stoppage around six or seven rounds. He's just too much of an executioner. His, his footwork, his counter ability, his left, his right. He's he's just got too much for Carroll. Carroll's really good in areas, but he's, he's a little too one-dimensional to cope with the experience and skill set of Josh Taylor but fair play for taking the fight I do not see an upset it may be an upset you never know but it, I, I don't think so I'm currently 60 and 11 on fight predictions I don't just go with the favourites I go with the underdogs as well but in most cases the favourites you've got to know usually who should win and who shouldn't on this one I'm going with Josh Taylor. I don't see the upset whatsoever. Um, but it'll be a jam-packed night. And I think Carroll will do a lot of things that he shouldn't when he gets in the ring with the crowd. I think, it, I'm not saying it will phase him, but I think it will change the way he boxes smart. And he'll try and turn it into a dog fight, which is only going to make it much easier for Josh Taylor to counter him and pick him apart. Uh, but fair play for taking the fight. You're mandatory, you've got balls, go to Scotland and see if you can get the job done there and upset a crowd. I don't think he will, but while it lasts, it will be entertaining for six or seven rounds. Peace. So Josh Taylor with the win in round seven is going to stop him.